Hi guys, so today we are going to do the question shuffle the array. Given the array nums consisting of two n elements in the form x1, x2, xn, y1, y2, 2yn, return the array in the form x1, y1, x2, y2 uh, up till xn, yn. So basically, uh, let's take this example where we are given an array of 2, 5, 1, 3, 4, 7. Right, so we are given that it is a 2 into n sized array and we are provided with the value of n. So we need to do it. What we need to do is we need to construct a resultant array where we have the um, we have a combination uh, such that we have the first digit and the n plus 1 ith digit. So we have 2, then 3. In the resultant vector, we have the answer like. Uh, the ith character followed by the n plus ith character then we have digits 5 followed by n plus i that is n is 3 plus 1 initially i is 0 then i is 1 then i is 2 so uh, initially we what we did is 3 plus 0 so it was here somewhere right so we did 2 comma 3 then what we added is ith character that is 5 then we add n plus ith character th that is 3 plus 1 so we add 4 then we increment the value of i that is uh, 2 2 so we'll add first the ith character that is 1 followed by n plus ith character that is 7 so this is the resultant array that we have so this is a very simple question let's code it so what we need is a vector of int we'll name it as answer right so what would be the size uh, initially let's not give any size fine then what we do is int i is equal to 0 i is less than n i plus plus since we just have to iterate half of the array till n fine so we are iterating up till n and then uh, what we do is answer dot pushback first we insert the ith character then n plus ith character right so uh, i push nums of i and then what i push is i'll take a pointer j int j is equal to n fine i'll point initially i'll point j to the nth character and then i'll insert the jth character and then what I'll do is increment j every time. So this is the resultant array and then we'll return it from the function. So let's run the code. So we've got a correct answer. On submitting what we get is we get a quite efficient solution. So this was an order of n solution that we discussed. I hope you guys have understood it. Give us a thumbs up. Bye-bye.